Hi there. My name is Teddy Ruxpin. How are you today? Well then, I would like to tell you the story of the faded fobs. One day, Grubby and I were in Boggly Woods picking wild strawberries. I really like strawberries. Do you? Hey, Teddy, there are lots of strawberries over here. Oh, good, Grubby. We should be able to fill up the basket with all of these. If you'll stop eating them, that is. Um, uh, oh, well, well, strawberry picking takes a lot of energy, and I've got to keep my strength up. <laughs> oh, is that right? Yeah. Besides, I pick four strawberries for every one of yours. <laughs> yeah, Grubby, you're right. I can't keep up with your eight hands. Two hands are better than one. Two hands are better than one. If you have a job that must be done, two hands are better than one. Four hands are better than two. Four hands are better than two. If you have a job that you've got to do, four hands are better than two. So lend a hand whenever you can. That's what one should do. And it might pay, cause then someday you might need help too. Eight hands are better than four. Eight hands are better than four. To pick up seashells at the shore. To sweep and mop and whack the floor. Speed up shopping at the store. Eight hands are better than four. are better than one, two hands are better than one. If you have a job that must be done, two hands are better than one. Four hands are better than two, four hands are better than two. If you have a job that you've got to do, four hands are better than two. So lend a hand whenever you can. That's what friends should do. And it might pay, cause then someday you might need help too. Oh, eight hands are better than four, eight hands are better than four. To fix and patch and paint the door To do push-ups until you're sore To clap your hands and yell for more Eight hands are better than four Four hands are better than two Two hands are better better than than one Grubby and I were almost finished picking the strawberries when we heard a strange sound. It was the sound of lots of little furry bobs. Hey, fellas. What's going on? Oh, hi, Teddy. Hi, Grubby. Hi, guys. We're really mad. Yeah, that's that really mm-hmm. mad. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And, and, and angry, too. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Aren't you? Well, what are you mad about? Well, just look at us. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah.
You've probably already guessed that Grubby's idea wasn't too good. Well, the fob said they must leave now because they had to walk a long way to get some water. But I thought they got their water from Rainbow Falls, just a short distance away. Well, Rainbow Falls dried up weeks ago. Yeah, weeks ago. Yeah, gone dry. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh -huh. We walked over to Rainbow Falls, and the fobs were right. Not a drop of water anywhere. That gave me an idea. Hey, by any chance, did your fur start to change colors just after Rainbow Falls dried up? That's when it was. As you can see, Rainbow Falls is at the base of a tall mountain. No one could remember the falls ever drying up before, and no one had ever been up there to see where the water comes from. Grubby had another idea. The only one I know of who's big enough and strong enough to climb up there to see what's wrong is the woolly what's it? This time, Grubby's idea was a good one. We went to the woolly what's its house to ask him to help us. Well, Penny, it's time for my nap. Right now. But, Woolly, look at the fobs. We need your help. Would you please? No, well, boy. I guess you need me more than I need my nap. I'm sure that when it's time for 